Take this angle, fabulous. From this angle, what is that? Welcome to Scarlet Rage Vintage. If you are watching this, I am sorry for what you're about to watch. I have tried to recreate Pinup Palmer's faux page boy hairstyle. If you see this and you see her original photo and you think, how did this happen? Watch this video. Cause it's fun. Now I'm going to take this out and cry into my bed. This is a good hairstyle if you haven't washed your hair in a few days, if it's been under a wig, just like mine, or if you're just really lazy and you don't feel like curling the whole entire thing. Let I feel so seen. First, you're going to need a one inch curling iron, a hair shark, double-sided really not double-sided i suggested i'll put the link down below uh -oh. or just a prank yeah, i just realized how if you want, but I have shark today. <laughs> some duck bill pins a whole lot of bobby pins okay a blow dryer okay some hairspray okay. and get whatever this thing is called and cut it in half see i did have that but my hair has got longer so i uh got a sock <laughs> rolled the donut that I split in half, put it in a sock, and let's see how that's gonna go, because this can go long or big or, you know, however you need. You're gonna wanna make a good clean section, whatever side that you want. Okay, good clean section, whatever side you want. Okay, I already feel like I'm not gonna be able to do this. Ooh, there's that. And also, do not hate my, uh, Roots, uh, you know, we're in quarantine right now, girls, and, well, needs must when you don't have a hairdresser and you can't be trusted to do your own hair, and I've seen the memes, don't use box dyes. So. I'm going to divide it into a couple different sections again. Okay. So the first one is going to be this. So you're going to take, see where the end is here? Find your ear, like I always say, always find it to be your ear. There we go. Go up with it. That's your section. Brush it, twist it, and just get it out of the way for now. All these sections, we're just gonna get out of the way. My second section will actually be my bang. So I'm gonna go kind of oh, to the center I, of my forehead here. What a ninny. All the way down from my ear. It's like I took my ear and I just went like whoop. Okay. About something like that. Take this, because this will be your bang. All of this that you see. All of that. Not curling today, bitch. No way. I just okay, love so this is where it gets a little weird. I like weird. I don't know how to describe it to you guys. What does this look like to you? I swear to God, this is a hair tutorial. I don't want it to say. So what you're gonna do with this contraption? Okay, that I've made, contraption. You're gonna stick it underneath your hair. And underneath you. Like so, and then you're gonna pin it in place. Okay. Okay, hold on, hold on, hold up, wait a minute, let me, ah! Okay, I think, have I, have I got it? Have I got it? And then... <laughs> oh my god. Okay. Okay, I think me and my whiteness are pinned. I like to under tease and I am folding and tucking my hair underneath that bun. Okay, so I am folding and tucking. I have <laughs> Okay, folding and tucking and I know this is probably your favorite things to watch me do shit like this but my god I tell you what doing hair is probably my like bane <laughs> oh my goodness gracious me why wasn't I blessed to be like a full functioning female who can get this kind of stuff understanding D was that even an I like you can definitely see the white bits. So once you're kind of happy with somewhat of the shape, take 
your bobby pins and find where the bump is, like the little blunt thing that you put in there, and start pinning it down. Some parts you may have to kind of brush out and re-kind of arrange. Finagle it a bit, it's not going to be perfect at first. I believe in you guys. I don't believe in me! I'm going to, I'm going to have to, I'm going to have to redo this because she is not correct. Okay. Okay. Right. Oops. Do this again. Under the hair. Under the hair. Find there. How's everyone's quarantine going? Last night I decided I needed to have a Disney night. That's what I felt like. So I watched my favourite movie, Monster Sink. Okay feel like that is so much better. So once you're kind of done with the bump thing, okay. it's actually time to curl, but we're only going to curl what we pinned, guys. So <gasps> let's unleash this first section here. However... Uh. Alright, let's get this out of the way and let's just focus on this and what we're gonna do guys is we're just gonna curl actually put it inside the barrel all the way down all right and so when you're done with your curl it should look something like that okay these don't have to be like excessively tight but if you want them go ahead and then i just kind of roll them back up and i pin them for now just to get them out of my face a little bit and so maybe you can hold a little bit of a better coral and we're just going to do the same thing for the rest of the hair see you guys later i tell you what these are probably some of the best curls i've ever done gun fingers let's that makes no sense fun take this get this out of the way do the exact same thing what you did on this side to this side roll it down Brush it out first. I just take pieces. So get it out of your face. Move on to the next layers. Yeah. Oh. Mm. Glad that was filming. Now you look like something out of Little Women. Uh oh! I'm so upset. My camera just died, so sorry if this is low quality. You're on my phone now. We're almost at the end. I hope. I hope. I hope. I hope. I hope. To be honest, I'm sorry to every YouTuber that I try and recreate their YouTube videos because <sighs> I'd hate me too. Like a, a really good sort of hair YouTuber needs to like just do like hair 101 for dummies and I would literally be on that like a car bonnet. <laughs> do I curl this one bit of hair? Yeah. I mean this is not how she looks in her video but hey. <laughs> I look like I don't know. I took out the duckbill clips and now I'm just kind of slightly brushing out my hair and seeing how- Okay. <laughs> okay, let's see what she says. Oh, the mold is. What I like to do is clip it in place and then I under tease the crap out of it. And then I slowly start to mold it into the other layers that I already had. It's creating one big bump. When you like it, pin it in place. Okay. Like that. And then do I. Done. Now that you look like something out of a Cindy Lover video, let's take it. Let's start brushing her over. Hold on. Okay, so I am taking my hair shark and I am gently brushing the teasing that I just did to my hair. And when I like the volume, I like to spray it in place and then use a hair dryer to hold it. So what you're going to do is you're going to start mold. 
molding these layers and under teasing. It's going to be like a process molding and under teasing, molding and under teasing. It's kind of tedious work. And you're going to have to really finagle your hair here and see what is kind of working for you and what kind of shape do you want to create. Once you like it, go ahead and pin it in place, hairspray it, and then keep molding, under teasing until something starts forming that you really dig. This I can do. This? Is it this way? Okay, well that seems to be... <laughs> Is this Cindy Lauper? Pen. <laughs> this looks nothing like what she's done. I'm sorry, Pen Up Palmer. I am sorry I have. done bad by you. I'm going to stop here because I don't know what's happened to me. I have lost it in all manners of fact. I think I've gone loony while doing this. <laughs> so if you guys liked this failure of a video, don't forget to like and subscribe. Uh, Pen up, Palmer. I'm so sorry. Maybe next time I can do better. But thank you guys. Don't forget to like and subscribe. Bye.